All right, so I had I had to I had a, I had a little problem with something. Some message came up, or I heard a sound. I don't know if you he he heard the sound, but I definitely did hear a sound. Or I th at least I thought I would have heard a sound. So I wanted to check what it was. Obviously, it wasn't anything at all. It, it was just my imagination playing this freaking computer sound in my mind. Here. Dang it! Didn't change the staging at all. All right, now that I'm back in this in the vehicle assembly building, why not just add boosters? What could what could possibly go wrong with adding boosters? Uh, probably quite a few things. <laughs> oh God! This is not going to end well with those boosters. I'm just. Just FYI, this is not going to end well. With my great incredible luck, this is not going to end well. Uh, just get those things over there. Where are the boosters? Here they are. Now, in the in the prior versions of KSP, you only had those little smaller boosters with a thrust of 250, which already was incredibly awesome. Actually, I I many people thought that they were just useful but I thought they really gave you really awesome boost now we got those gigantic things with like 400 thrust and that is and that is amazing that is those things are just amazing they have a burn time of like 30 seconds only five seconds longer than the old ones as you can see they're 25 30 but they are they have so much thrust really so much thrust and especially, sorry, they, they don't have to warm up at all. They don't have to warm up or anything like the, the other engines do. And waste fuel already. Bec they they just going like at 400 thrust from right from the beginning on. And I think that that is completely awesome. I really, really, I always loved boosters. I did ever try to avoid them for some reason. I think it was because... Uh, in the end, I uh, after a certain time at the beginning, I thought they were awesome. I still think they were, they are awesome, but after a certain time, I noticed that the that the proportion between the weight and the thrust, or the drag and the thrust, or the the, the problems it gives the aircraft compared to the thrust and the burn time, isn't really worth it. Also, if you if you fire boosters and then you disconnect them, now your aircraft, or s sometimes, if you did it wrong, what I obviously <laughs> did, because I'm bad at this game, or not that good at this game, uh, that they... Basically, the, the air, the, 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 your spacecraft either just didn't go up after that, or just slowed down to like z zero meters per second, and then just went down directly. Or, also in some cases, uh, cases I have... Or no, actually, that that was the less often thing, if I can say that. What I have mostly experienced it was that I uh, that they that the rocket like slowed down to ten meters per second, and then slowly went up again. And when it was at like half of the speed it had before, or would have had before be without the boosters, uh, the the fuel tanks were already empty, <laughs> so that that was the point where when I realized that I decided to stop using solid fuel boosters. Boosters. Now I'm st using them again because they're giving me quite a bit of boost. Start this rocket. Much much quicker start. Much 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 quicker start. Much much quicker. A little bit more wobbly as well, but they just kind of break from the Actually. Hope and hope that they won't destroy any important parts of the rocket. All right, perfect. As you can see, the rocket is slowing down. I think it is not as no, it is definitely not as not as uh, dramatically as it was before. Now it's already going up again, and much quicker than before. So that was that was one thing that really annoyed me. Literally, that really annoyed me just. 
so much. No one is is it there anymore and I'm thinking that is awesome. Uh, and I'm already going at a hundred after one minute four at exactly a hundred. Before la last last time it was it like there, there. That is that is amazing. That was amazing indeed. I think I, I'm I'm confident guys, I think this design might actually work. <laughs> <laughs> but now my vertical speed is going up. Awesome. Uh, I'm like just past a thousand liters. Uh, let's just see how this will turn out. Let's just see it. Yeah, let, let's just see how this will turn out. position of my apoapsis because what I uh, noticed is that when the vertical speed increases or the speed increases in general then the apoapsis is going up much much quicker than before see it's already it's, it's increasing much quicker than it was before see it's just basically shooting up into the air A thousand left at 70,000 I'm gonna stop 50 or actually already at 60 60 is, 60 is really enough. Stop the engines right there. 313 and 3200. Much, much more. I think it was, I think it's about twice as much as I had last time. Alright, now turn this for a little bit. Yes, those engines are actually uh, thrust vectoring engines. And then get into our position. And as I guess, hold that thought and turn off the thrust vectoring engines. As I guess off, as I guess on. Turn on the thrust vectoring engines. Turn them off. That's my method of getting to smooth stop, and I'm perfectly even. And I'm. My plan worked out perfectly fine. At 20 seconds I'm gonna burn again, and this time I might even get into an orbit. And burn. Right now, burn. As you can see, this is this is kinda bad because this is actually using up my my energy right there, my thrust. My my fuel. Come on, Apops, I, I want you to go away from me. I don't wanna pass you. I don't want to pass you. I do not want to. Oh god, I passed it. I passed it. I just passed it. And now hold me there. So that we, that I'm a little bit further, obviously. Because I want to get behind it again. Yeah, actually, this is working out quite well. If now my fuel is alright, then that would be just awesome. Yeah, my fuel is empty. Oh god, so close, guys. So close. God damn it. You know what? Let's just uh let's just put those engines right. Let's just put those two things right there. Yeah, that that can't be good. I don't know. I don't know that much about about like planes and stuff, but I don't think it can be good if your wings snap off. Actually, where am I? Where's my staging over there? You know what? I'm gonna try to get lost in space, which obviously won't won't uh, won't achieve. <laughs> oh god! Yeah, just just end that flight. Uh, I might have to do some long-term studies about this or something. Uh, yeah, now as a little end of it, uh, this episode is going to be extremely long. I'm going to show you. I might even split it into probably sp will split it into. <laughs> I will show you my KSP biplane. My so far 
most amazing and most uh, or not maybe, maybe not most amazing but my best working plane not not really a space plane but a plane now for this I'm going to use my this joystick here if it would work dang it why you no work all right so 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 I won't use the joystick as it isn't working this is working and however it isn't some of, some of the things are working. Some of, some of them aren't. That is strange. Whatever. I'm. Wait. Did I accidentally? Well, whatever. Just, just do it this way. No. Finally, engines. This is a Balothar made rocket engine biplane. Extremely realistic. First time where I actually used those engine and cell bodies where I actually figured out how to use them. Oh god, and I'm going up. Oh god, and SAS, stop me. Alright. Stop me from killing myself. Oh, 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 Kermit. Uh, get a little reference that probably none of you is going to understand. Or maybe one of you. <laughs> probably one of you. This is working. I've actually got a real biplane. Well, ma maybe not a real biplane, but a biplane well enough to call itself a biplane. Which is working well enough to call itself a biplane. Uh, actually, does the, do those things have fuel as well? I don't know. Whatever. I don't, don't really know where, where I got that idea from. But I ju just made that biplane. What I find a little bit strange that those wing connectors wing wing and wing connectors which are basically just nothing else than boards really they, they look like plastic boards uh, nothing else they are not aren't even shaped like wings and they they are actually taking me up that is amazing that's what amazes me so uh, squat uh, maybe Fix that little graphic error. If you, if you, on the other hand, you can, after all, put things on top, uh, right there, right? Wait, am, did I run out of fuel? What the hell? Oh no, sh sugar! I, oh god, I stalled. Cause my fuel efficiency went down to like 0 0.19. <laughs> I actually want to do a freaking looping. Dang it! That is not going to work then. Slow down, get down there again. Yep, no, not that way. Get! Ga ga ga! Alright, now, now, I, now I'm screwed. Oh, you got a reason to worry. As I guess, you're not doing your job very well. Why? What on earth? Why on earth is this happening? Um, this is probably not the best idea. Might want to turn on those smooth controls. Oh god, what exactly is happening? I do not know at all. Oh god, Al Kerman, prepare for bailout. Oh, 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 oh. I am in the air again. After a little bit of a strange occurrence, I am in the air again. Let's do the looping and then just uh, try to land. Well, actually, no, no, no. Try, try to land right now because I'm actually in a good position to do that. Oh god, I might not. Oh. No, what did I do? Oh god, is it is it working? Is it working? Please, please work. Please, just please work. Yes, it's working. Great. I probably even lost hate with that. Oh, get over there. Get over there, thing. Get over there. I need you to get over there a little bit. I might actually crash into the debris things right there. Yeah, the, this thing. This thing? That, that was German. This thing and this thing can do. Actually, can do a looping. That is quite awesome.
Oh god, no, I don't want to go up, I want to go down. I don't think I can land on like a stream of air. <laughs> that, that would be quite new to me. Oh god, I might want to put the gear down. And you actually, uh, what I want to do with the bailout. Normally, uh, you can actually EVA these guys. Let them go on EVA. That is awesome. That is really, really awesome. You can actually walk on the moon. Which is actually written M U N here, so man or moon or moon or whatever you want to call it. Uh, this planet is called Kerbin. Not e this, is, this is not even the Earth, right? This is Kerbin. This is, that is why those guys look a little bit strange. I might want to pull up my nose. I mean, the, the, the plane's nose. You, you, this plane is so good at gliding. Oh my god, this is amazing. Can I actually? Parachute. I actually have this parachute there. Why can't I not activate it? Dang it, I want to activate this freaking parachute. Whatever. Don't use the brakes too much. Alright, L. Oh, there's the KSP. K KSC, sorry. Alright, this was success. Blah, blah, blah. Whatever. <laughs> what was that just there? <laughs> that was successful. So I'm going to end the flight. And this is it for this one or two, I don't know, episodes. So, so something else in the train, travel space program. Actually, it was just to test out the new microphone. I think it works. I've tried it out with some tests. Couldn't couldn't really say how well it works because I never recorded an actual episode without having the intent to upload it. But yeah, now, now I have. Now I have done exactly that. I think this is working quite well. My pro hope hopefully, uh, I am recording this on Friday. I don't. I'm not sure when it will go up. Probably Saturday, not Friday. I, I don't know. Not 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 after Saturday. So yeah, I will see you in the next episode, which might or might not be pre-recorded, depending on whether or not I will or will upload a train episode next. <laughs> so yeah, uh, until then, I will see you then. Obviously.